Hi everyone, welcome back to the YouTube channel Auto Vibe. Today we are going to talk about one of the most advanced warships in the Philippine Navy, the BRP Antonio Luna FF-151. This frigate is the second ship of the Jose Rizal class, and it plays a very important role in strengthening the maritime defense of the Philippines. The BRP Antonio Luna was built by Hyundai Heavy Industries in South Korea and was officially commissioned into the Philippine Navy on March 19, 2021. It is named after General Antonio Luna, a famous Filipino general who was remembered for his courage, leadership, and brilliance during the Philippine-American War. The naming of this vessel honors his legacy while symbolizing strength, resilience, and independence. This modern warship is designed as a guided missile frigate. It has a displacement of around 2,600 tons and measures 107 meters in length, with a beam of 14 meters. Despite being smaller compared to destroyers, the Antonio Luna is packed with advanced systems, making it a powerful multi-role vessel. Its primary mission is to conduct anti-air, anti-surface, and anti-submarine warfare, as well as patrol, surveillance, and humanitarian operations. The ship is powered by a combined diesel and diesel CODAD propulsion system, which gives it a top speed of about 25 knots and an endurance of around 4,500 nautical miles. This means it can operate for extended periods at sea without the need for frequent refueling. Its speed and range make it well suited for patrolling the vast Philippine waters, including the West Philippine Sea where maritime security challenges are increasing. In terms of armament, BRP Antonio Luna carries a 76mm Oto Malara Super Rapid Gun as its primary weapon for surface targets and air defense. It is also equipped with anti-ship missiles, surface-to-air missiles, torpedo launchers, and a close-in weapon system CIWS, for last-ditch defense against incoming threats. The ship also has advanced radar and sonar systems, allowing it to detect and track multiple targets at long ranges. One of the key features of this frigate is its helicopter deck and hangar, which can support operations of a naval helicopter like the A-159 Wildcat. This greatly enhances its anti-submarine and surveillance capabilities. With this addition, the ship can extend its reach far beyond the radar and sensors installed onboard. Aside from combat missions, the BRP Antonio Luna can also participate in humanitarian assistance and disaster relief operations. The Philippines frequently faces natural disasters like typhoons and earthquakes, and the Navy uses ships like Antonio Luna to deliver aid, medical supplies, and rescue teams to affected areas. The commissioning of BRP Antonio Luna marked a major milestone for the Philippine Navy's modernization program. Together with its sister ship, BRP Jose Rizal, it represents the start of a new era for the country's naval defense. Both ships give the Philippines greater capability to safeguard its territorial waters, protect trade routes, and strengthen its presence in regional maritime security. In conclusion, BRP Antonio Luna FF-151 is more than just a warship. It is a symbol of national pride, a protector of Philippine sovereignty, and a step forward in building a modern navy for the future. 